Hello folks, um, it's been a while since the last time I posted a video but uh, today I just want to show you how to install uh, ATI drivers on your Ubuntu system so uh, let's begin now the first one is actually pretty simple because when you fir for the first time install Ubuntu this one should pop up automatically is this one additional drivers so let's open that one and uh, see it's uh, searching for available drivers should take too long at least I think so um, but we'll just wait okay here we go let's see you will install this ATI slash AMD proprietary FGLRX graphics driver so uh, what you do is just press this one uh, with me it says remove with you it says something with install so just press on that one and you have to um, restart your PC after so um, that's pretty easy but the next one is if this doesn't pop up then you can go to let's see uh, synaptics it's right here so let me zoom in you can quick search for HCI and here we go okay AMD HCI display driver wrapper this one uh, AMD HCI Radeon display driver um, so that there's a few um, options here and of course you will need to install the FGLRX video driver for the HEI graphics accelerators and let's see um, of course this one is very useful catalyst control center for the HEI graphics accelerators so uh, that's a way to do that um, there's a few tools here you'll need utility to control the ATI radium backlight functions on laptops so if you don't have a laptop with that specific thing you don't need to install that uh, we have ATI match 64 display driver okay there's a few here but basically you just need to install them and that's it so let's see yeah the third one last one actually is you just go to the AMD website and let's see support and drivers click on that one and right here it says download graphics drivers uh, please select the value select the type of system that you have I've got a desktop uh, Radeon HD series and is Radeon HD 5XX series PCI Express and I will select Linux 64 bit because that's one I'm using you can also choose Linux 32 bit okay so we will display results and right here we got the driver it says HEI Catalyst 10.10 .10 proprietary Linux driver display driver that's the one right here just press download and you can find it in your downloads section so it's right here in downloads okay HEI driver installer so when you just double click it will do like this okay oh no you can't do anything oh no yeah what you need to do is right click go down to properties go to permission and go to allow executing file as a program okay there we go and close now just double click and we say run in terminal there we go that's how you do it 
simple right so um, a quick wi video on how to do that so I hope you enjoyed catch you guys later have a nice day and bye